Welcome. In this session we're going to learn how to program version 1 of our Songs and Rhymes project. You should have the Python idle development environment open. I'm going to go ahead and type in Notepad because the text will be larger so it would be easier for you to see. Alright, so what I've done is I've already put in my class information. I've put in the file name, the version, happy birthday 1, my name, the class information and the assignment information. Under the assignment information I'd like you to put in all of the different concepts that you're going to learn in each version. So the main idea behind this Songs and Rhymes project is incremental development process. In other words, um, developing a little bit of the program and then adding functionality to it every time that you program a new version. So go ahead and take a second to do that before we go on. If you need to, you can go ahead and stop the recording for a minute. All right, I'm going to go on. So now what we need to do is we need to put in a general comment. You should do this for each of your versions. The comment should describe what's going on in the program. So I'm going to say something like this program uh, prints and speaks or sings the song Happy Birthday. Alright, so then we're going to import our Myro library, so from Myro import, and we'll need an asterisk at the end. And then this is a very simple version, so we're just going to do it in the main. So we'll define the main function, so def main, and then if you're typing in idle, it should automatically indent for you. So then the first thing we're going to do is print each line of our song to the screen. For your project, you'll need to pick your own song. So I'm going to print out each line. So happy birthday to you. And then the next line. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Thomas. And then the last line, happy birthday to you. All right, so that is how you do the print version. And we're going to go ahead and comment this out because what eventually we want to happen is that the computer actually sings the song to you. But it's always a good idea to know what the lines of the song actually are. So it's very easy to change it to have the computer sing it to you, so I'm just going to copy these lines and I'm going to change each print to a speak and also put my text in parentheses. So you can go ahead and do that with your version that you're working on. And once we have both of these versions done, of course, we're going to need to make a call to the main. So we'll type in main, open and close parentheses at the bottom. So now in order to test it, I'm going to copy and paste it from Notepad into my IDE. So I'm going to go File, New. And let me move the window over here for you guys so you can see it. I'll paste it in. I'm going to hit Run. And now it's going to ask me to save it. So I'll go here and I'm going to navigate to a folder I've created on my network drive and you should remember to save every version of your project to a folder so that you don't lose it. And I named it the same name as my file name at the top, happy birthday version 1 and all files need to end in PY so we're going to hit save and I already had a practice version so I'm going to overwrite it and now we'll just wait for the development environment to bring it up and I don't know if you heard it through my mic but it did sing it to me alright so that's it for this version you, again you'll need to pick your own song for your project 
and I will see you next time where, where we'll talk about uh, functions and parameters. See you soon.